took an about two hours trying to go into Tower Fantasy and actually play it. You know, I've been wanting to play it for a while. And I've been thinking the whole time that my computer really isn't that great, and you know, the footage would all lag. If you've seen how I played Honkai Impact, the gameplay and everything lagged in there. And back then, I didn't exactly have a phone I could even play that on that would even work. The last phone I had didn't even play it. And the computer had a hard time not even just lagging the whole time. Now, I've tried to go into Tower of Fantasy and find a way to make sure that the game wouldn't lag. I've gone to look at it with Bandicam when I was actually able to. It's not even, you can't even play it on PC right now because the servers are all buggy. I'm on it on my phone right now, and in there, the game is just lagging, my computer just can't do it. It can't record it either, no matter what I do, it cannot record it well at all. But when I get on here, on my phone, everything is smooth in there, everything is smooth, and my controller is on the phone through Bluetooth. Like, man, I didn't even know you could do that shit. I didn't know that if you held the share button and the PlayStation Home button, that you could even connect a fucking controller to your phone by the Bluetooth. But, but apparently you can. And I'm doing it right now in the game. Everything is smooth. And I can just record it through my phone with the screen record function that's in the phone. And I can just upload it to a Google Drive. And then copy it to my USB. And put it on my PS4. And edit it through that. It sounds like a whole lot of damn whoops I gotta go through just to edit the shit. And because it's not Pokemon. The old Pokemon games where it's just a bunch of pixels. It's gonna take a while to copy on there, but I did it for Honkai Impact, it's just an extra step of waiting. Probably have to would wait until the next day to edit anything because of the processing time. And because I'm doing this right now, as like I don't really need to talk about it. I could talk about it when I'm recording the game, but I'm also doing this because I'm trying to figure out if it was the last uh, controller charger I had that made the static sound play through the microphone because I had this in the controller I used to play on Honkai Impact on the computer when I plugged it in there and that used to make static on the console or you know through the microphone so I'm trying to see here if that is trying to do anything or not so basically yeah that's my plan play the game on the phone record it through there upload it on a Google Drive and then copy it from there, put it on my PS4, and edit everything from there. And just only play the game on my phone, which is doing like 10 times better than the PC can do. Which, you would think that a PC would be much stronger and able to handle it than a phone would. But, I don't, I don't get that shit, so... I only understand consoles, I don't understand uh, computers and phones like that, so... That's pretty much all I have to say. And if this is all staticky bullshit that you're hearing, then this isn't exactly gonna be sounding right. And it's not static, it's buzzing. I've been fucking around with my computer for two hours, my brain isn't working with me. And I'm annoyed as hell, so... If I found a good plan on how to get this working, then I'm gonna deal with it and I'll be happy with it. And now I'm just trying to figure out if my phone is actually dying very fast from playing the game. That's that's all I gotta say about it. I've already recorded a whole thing explaining what's going on here. I'm not even gonna start with an intro. The worst thing about this is not the long period of what I have to do to record this. No, it's that I gotta play this entire game, or at least for a pretty long time until it comes to console or something. I gotta play this game on my phone. Like, I'm sitting here, I got a controller in my hands, and I'm playing on a phone? I should be playing on my big piece. 
I should be playing on my computer or the TV screen, but I end up doing it on the phone. But if that's the best case, nothing wags, nothing stops, that's the best case for me. Also, I would have liked to have been, as you can see here, I've, this one, the Fantasia, is the one that I hopped in when it didn't want to work on PC. This one, the 7, is the one I walked into to test out the stuff on the mobile device. But because I do want to get the intro in, we need to go through, uh, the one I was just in doesn't work. Okay, we're gonna go in through Azure Plane. And if you want to know what settings I got set up here, I have this. All that stuff is on Extreme. Alright, if I'm going to do this on my phone, everything good is going on here. Everything good is happening. All that good stuff is happening. We're not messing around. We're not missing a single beat here. Not at all. Now I have to use my computer as a clock because my iPad is actually dead. So, there we go. My computer is now the clock. Now, let's go in here, and I'm going to fucking play this game because I've been waiting a long time to play it, and I should have been playing it earlier today, but I was having fun with Zack and Saints Row. This is an awkward setup I have, too. You wish to see me, my lord? Hykros has sent someone into the quarantine zone. It's time to release the house. Target signal lost. I can't locate it anymore. Careful. Something about this place doesn't feel right. Here? How? Run! It's a trap! We need to lose them. selection thing, kind of like, uh, Genshin does it. I didn't turn off any notifications that could pop up. That's gonna be great. If I just turned on Don't Disturb, that would also have helped. Which I should probably just do right now. You know I'm doing this on a phone, so what does it matter? Let me just do that. Do Not Disturb. There you go. to tell me I would be doing something like this years ago, I'd be saying, why would I do it like that, and how would that even be possible? I don't think a controller can connect to a phone. I don't see myself uploading footage from my phone onto a computer. I can't even record the screen on the phone. I wouldn't be playing a game on the phone that looks good. Today's definitely not my day. I mean, look at the, I, this works, and this is clear, then nothing's lagging here, right? Hopefully in post it won't be lagging. The only problem is that my phone really drains from this. Anyway. And I wish the options wouldn't be on the screen the whole time. I think I still need to press these myself. These don't seem to... Yeah, these don't work yet. I would still have to do these myself. Yeah, you, you still gotta do this yourself. Okay, go back. Okay. Unable to use the functions. Hmm. Yeah, I just wish this wasn't in the way. Oh 
Oh shit, you can move these boxes? You can also break them. So we got our dodge here, our jump, our attack, what other buttons do we have? I, the controller I think isn't even exactly fully optimal yet. But it doesn't matter. Now where am I supposed to be going? This way? Also I do like that the character themselves actually does seem to talk. Oh, a weapon. I'm gonna need that. How do you pick it up? Circle. A mine. This wasn't mentioned in the intel. Energy reserves are low. Oh, please don't fail me now. No! Those monsters aren't here. Oh, well, this is perfect. Uh, try. Okay. So I'm gonna have to learn these buttons myself, is all. I have to figure out a way to get out of here. We're climbing the wall like we do in Genshin. We can just jump off from circle. There's a lot of you guys in here. So wait, it's funny because I can be playing the game with a controller, but like someone else, if they, why does it have my name doing it? Come on, just a little longer. Like someone else could be touching the the screen, messing with buttons too. Did you say her? Uh, excuse me, I, I do believe I'm a guy. This is Genshin, but backwards now, because I played as, play as Wumin in there, and they're like, take something, something him, and it's like, excuse me? Is it going to be something, something her in this game? Though they have advertised the female more. How am I supposed to do my own roleplay if the protagonist themselves speaks? How am I going to know when to talk?
Suppressor seems to be fine. No need to worry. Where am I? Huh. Your suppressor has been replaced with a new energy cell. Feeling better? Much better. And you are? Oh, she's... Her voice acting isn't in at this point. You've been out for a whole day. I thought you were... Oh, and your weapon is on top of that crate. Don't forget to pick it up. My weapon? Oh, right. <sighs> Always been good with swords. grow up here? We have been living here since we were very little. There weren't a lot of people back then. Everyone chipped in to build this place little by little. Hmm? See, there's a few moments where it lags like this, but I can take it. I see we have created a new Paimon. So nice red and thirty. You may proceed over at any time. This is Greetings. I am Mia, a four generation smart servant. Something's wrong with your circuits. Zeke found her in one of the ruins. But its language model is a little buggy, so it talks funny sometimes. I apologize. I will do my best to make my speech intelligible. Oh, you're fine, Mia. <laughs> Come with me, please. We should not keep Miss Celine waiting. Are every is every time she walks a little like little plush sound? Stern shoulders aren't familiar to me. Zeke and Shirley took me up. Took an unconscious me in, yet I can't recall anything before that, except a feeling of unease. What happened? I'll have to look into it. How do I get that off my screen? Level up. Okay. Uh. I'll do manual. Battleship up ahead? That's the Bethlehem. My brother said it's been here for 50 years. 50 years? Yeah, when the cataclysm took place, an Omnium explosion destroyed an entire fleet that was patrolling nearby. Only the Bethlehem managed to land on the island. The shelter was built around its huh? remains. Hey, that's Celine. Let's head on over. Oh my god, what is with this gangster walk? <laughs> Why do I have a gangster walk, man? Oh my god, I'm gonna shoot somebody. So, you're the one they rescued from outside? Why do you not sound so happy to see me, miss? Uh, hello. I'm here to- You don't seem to be older than Shirley. The outside world must not have been kind to you. What is this? And why am I standing on it? This is starting to give me some strange PTSD. Yes. Ah, there we are. See, this is the Alex that I am. Yeah, alright, that's enough. This is the Alex that I am. Come on now. Save and use this book. Here I am. Back again. So how do I, how would I talk to someone else on from the controller? I don't think it matters. Go greet Celine. Okay. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Mia hopes you will pay more attention to your health. If you are injured, 
Promptly bandage the wound. Mia can provide immediate emergency treatment guidance. I still don't. I hate my gangster walk. Nothing like some brand new clothes, am I right? Brand new clothes, Miss. Uh, I had a complete makeover to what I really look like. Thanks for your help. Anyway, now that's done. You can really show the newcomer around the shelter. See if anything needs help. I think she likes you. This is the control room. You can monitor every nook and cranny of the shelter here. Let's see. Would you like to chat with me? Okay, you say that and then you just let me walk away. Uh, what is it? Uh, about the ruins. It's also peaceful inside. Yeah. What, what the what? What, huh? There must be things we can still use in the ruins. If only someone was brave enough to go inside and get them out. Those things transcend time. They would still work in another century or more. I, I'm sorry to almost have attacked you. Uh, about the shelter. Listen, there are no good or bad people in the app seat in the shelter. Everyone is fighting for their own survival and purpose. You know, that's going to be funny when recording these things, that I'm going to look on my TV, and then I'm going to see, whoa, power mode. If they did something bad someday, please don't just jump at the chance to blame them. You don't know what they did. Maybe something good, or maybe something even worse. What is it? I'm sorry, but I'm not at liberty to discuss the ruin with you. All I can say is that you intend to enter the ruin, you will best take every precaution before doing so. No, that's not what I want to do. Now, a part of me did kind of want to just play this as, like, you know, maybe Renesme or something, but I was like, eh, why don't I come on back since the character talks the whole time, so why not? And who knows, maybe I might replay the whole game and dub the story stuff. This is only a shelter on a small island. Its surrounding environment is incredibly harsh. Despite the un undeal uh, conditions, the people here have given up hope. Have never given up hope. And work hard to survive every day. You know, you really need to remember that never given up part. Well, get on with it already! According to our calculations, there are many traces of multiple human use in the ruin. Up. Uh, see? The server hasn't been doing too great today. As everyone's trying to get in and stuff, so you, ca you can't exactly blame them for that, because they're really trying to get their game to work. And I've lost connection to the, uh, place. That's, uh, that's great. Oh, goodness gracious. This is gonna still be very difficult to mess with, isn't it? Because, I mean, w what else am I able to do? Oh wait, I'm still here? Oh, I thought you completely disconnected me. Yeah, uh, I guess we're done then? Stop keeping me from my work already. Get out of my face! Alright, dude, sheesh. Uh, hello. Wanna have a drink and chat a little? Our shelter is not so bad when you compare it to the other shelters. I'm not bragging, but our shelter occupies the key area in full of Astera. It's a natural de defensive position. I really don't like that guy from Hykuros. How he hoards the attention of all the girls in the shelter. Finny seems to have been charmed by him as well. She doesn't really talk to too much to me now. Oh well. Want a drink? If you're ever feeling thirsty, feel free to swing by. I'll whip you up some of the best juice in the entire Astera shelter. You give me Wiso vibes from the looks I can get of you. The hell is that? Cooking? I can do cooking? Uh, hey there. All my wares are sold out for today. Please come back later. Uh, okay. Oh god, there's so many people to talk to. What is it? A 
about that message board? Whatever you need to spread the word about something. It's best if we use the bulletin board. Otherwise, your message might get intercepted by those ravagers and used against your other people. Excuse me, have you seen uh, Lila? Or is it Lila? I want to say sorry to her, but I don't know where she went. See, the other problem about recording all this on my phone is that one episode's done, it's got to be immediately dealt with. Which, I mean, the game does, doesn't does close or anything, it just sets me right where I'm sitting. So that's nice, but I, it all has to be done immediately afterward. So... Is there any recruitment information from Bangs? Did you see any? It's like it doesn't. I have to click it myself. What is it? You want to chat with an old woman like me? I don't remember exactly, but this shelter didn't used to be here. It was built by someone later on. Back then, no living thing would want to be in Estella, but someone came along and wanted to build a shelter here. More about Zeke. Zeke, I still remember how petite he was when he first got here. If my grandson was still alive, he'd be Zeke's age right now. I can tell the kid had a hard life. The face says that much. Huh. I get- again, I hate the male character's walk. It is awful. <sighs> Our humanity is what- humanity is what makes us human, but the world is chipping it away. So how much exploring can I do right now? Shh, just relax quietly. Huh, you need something. About Zeke. Zeke's been through more hardship than any child should ever experience. After losing both his parents at a young age, all he had left was his little sister. She's not gonna die now, is she? Uh, hey there. I'm busy. Ask someone else for help if you have questions. Okay, asshole. Hmm. I do like the look of the place and everything. Uh, let's see here. Character... Yep, that'd be about right. Oh, can you change the name anytime? Edit birthday? Yes, please. Because this is, uh, this isn't right at all. Why is there a 10% off in there? Yeah, that's fine. Because I'm going to be his Alex throughout, like, the whole story, so. Is that really supposed to be the female avatar? Because she's not blue. That's not even actually an outfit for her at all. And this is the old Shirley. Avatar frame? Hmm. Weapons. Hmm. Backpack, friends, settings. I don't really need to mess with any settings, but we're just gonna have another look in them right quick. Just wanna make sure everything is good for me. Oh, this is our gotcha area. Terminal? Oh, don't go looking in there. Friends, I have none of those in here. Uh, close that out. What's this? Can't click on any of that. You know what? We're not looking at that. This is the chat. Everyone around here, everyone having fun in the world. That's not- wait. 
No, no, it's not open to hear people, to see people talking? Okay. Well, probably because I'm in the tutorial and, well, it's not going to open up like that. Hello there. About Zeke. Zeke? I think he's the most handsome guy in the shelter. Hey, hey don't tell S uh, Sorot I said that. Sure, Zeke's good looking, but he's always distant and cold. Despite that, he's quite reliable most of the time. Hi, right, what can I do for you? About Shirley. Shirley's an adorable girl. Her smile is like the sun that always brings warmth to others. She's a bit mischievous like a child. Every time she did something bad, she hid behind Zeke. I'm sorry about that. She has the power to bring warmth and peace to people around her. She's been by my side, caring for me always. I wanted to pay her back, but for someone as clumsy as me, all I did was make her upset. Sarod is a brick and not romantic at all. Everyone around him finds him dumb. I would have cared. I wouldn't have cared about him otherwise. Wow. That's mean. You wouldn't have cared about him otherwise. Huh? Well, a lot of people have said it, and I'm gonna say it too. I do get a Borderlands feeling from this game. What? What is that down there, and why does it exist? I think I've talked to everybody. I think. Morning, Shirley. Morning, Uncle Paul. Is this the one you rescued? How are we feeling today? Huh? So, how was collecting data? Um, what are we talking about? Oh my god, how many times can I go in the air like that? What the hell are you doing? What the hell? Let me down. What is this thing? How does it feel to fly? Don't work. Wait, hey, where are you going? Come back. Retrieving records. Shirley crashed into a river during her most recent flight. Um, that... Okay. The drone will wait for you here. Don't wander too far, though. Yeah. You can climb anything. So what's the fall damage in this game like? How fast can I just get myself killed here? Whoa. for a while, so stay focused on the task, all right? Huh. Okay. Drop me. What is this, man? Out there. Don't stray too far from the shelter. Man, I'm having a look at things. 